Hi, my name is Matt Smith, Kendall Jackson Winemaker, and today we're going to be sharing our next step in our Vineyard Practices series, and this time we're devoting uh, the video to leafing, which is the practice of removing leaves to expose the fruit as it's starting to grow in the vineyards. Hi, I'm Matt Smith, winemaker for Kendall Jackson, and I'm out in beautiful Bennett Valley, California, with my vineyard manager, Brian Malone. Brian is the vineyard manager not only for this property, but a lot of our vineyards from here west out to the Sonoma Coast. And we're out here today, uh, it's a gorgeous day, perfect day in California, and we're out here to discuss leaf removal. And leaf removal is something that we're doing in the vineyard at this time of the year. Um, we've already had uh, berry pollination and the berries are starting to expand, so now's the time to get in and remove leaves around the clusters. So, Brian, you know, it, it may sound odd to hear the words removing leaves. We've spent a lot of time growing these plants to make sure that they're happy and they're um, producing sugars for the ripening fruit and carbohydrates for the plant itself. Why on earth would we want to remove leaves? Well, you're right, a healthy plant does lead to high quality fruit. Uh, the reason uh, why we're removing those leaves is actually to reduce the amount of uh, disease that may occur if we keep those leaves in place. The other reason is we re re remove the leaves uh, in order to get sunlight exposure onto the fruit, which uh, helps with the uh, maturation process. So what we see here is a vine where we have yet to remove any leaves. It's hard to tell, but right behind this leaf layer are bunches of grapes that are starting to, to grow and mature. So what we want to do is open that up, remove leaves, and that will allow sunlight to penetrate and allow air circulation to remove, uh, to lessen the chance of any rot or mold. So we want to come in either by hand or by machine and remove this layer of leaves physically. And like that, we expose the, the fruit to the sun. We have a section of the vineyard where we have removed leaves by a machine. Now, the mechanized process is part of the sustainable vineyard efforts that we have at Kendall Jackson. As many of you probably know, all of the Kendall Jackson vineyards are certified sustainable, not only by the California Code of uh, sus Sustainable Farming, but also the SIP certification, which is the uh, sustainability and practice, which is a very stringent set of uh, practices. Now, why is mechanization more sustainable? It definitely allows us to get a lot of, of work done um, and reduce the amount of labor, which is in short supply. So I, I consider that to be something that's very sustainable for the future. Um, as you can see, the leaves have been removed. The machine has a, a set of rollers that just grab a leaf like that, pull it in, and shred it off. One of the downsides to using a, um, a machine to do leafing is that it doesn't do as complete a job as a hand crew might do. First of all, you see some leaves that are only partially removed, those are still there, and others um, that are on laterals, and those are usually not removed. And there's also a few leaves in and around behind that a hand crew would remove. Now these leaves will tend to grow back out now that the first layer has been removed and shade the, the berries again. So we'll come through either with a hand crew and do a little finishing work or with the machine on a second pass to clean it up again. And either way, it does a really good job of getting us down the line to where we want to go with the berries exposed and promoting circulation uh, in, in amongst the clusters.